Hello, I'm Dan. I'm Doug, wearing Hoobastank. My first concert that I went to ever was David Lee Roth and Poison at the Great Western Forum out in Los Angeles. Um, I just remember, I mean, I remember the whole thing, but I remember thinking at the time when the music started that it was so loud that it was almost like, oh my god, like it hurts my ears, and, and the bass was so thunderous that it shook the entire arena. And I just thought, like, holy cow, like, how could something be so loud and so heavy, even though it was just poison and David Um But it was so entertaining. Um, and, yeah, it wasn't one of those things where I'm like, from that day on, I knew I wanted to be in music. But it definitely uh, planted a seed in me about, like, the power of live music. Um, because up to that point, I'd never experienced anything like that. It was, like, this huge arena thing. Well, my first concert was a concert that you were at as well, but we didn't go together. Um, I went to the, my first concert was Lollapalooza in 1992, which was a really cool first concert. Um, it had, uh, the Chili Peppers headlined it, it had Pearl Jam, Soundgarden, I think Ice Cube. There was a second stage and Tool was on the second stage and Rage Against the Machine was on the second stage. Uh, Ministry played, I can't remember. I remember that concert thinking, I love all like so many of these bands, and that's actually them. It was a weird thing to go like, I see them on MTV and I see them on my you know cassette or, or CD covers, but that's them. This is them actually. And here. they're all here. Yeah, yeah. I, I remember the fact that Soundgarden and and uh, Pearl, Jam Pearl Jam played. Yeah, it was, was just insane. It's my first time. I was like, I was young. I was a little kid. I didn't have a driver's license. Nothing. I, I forget even how the fuck I got there. Um, and I was just soaking it all in, man, and just, like you said, you know, seeing these people that you would only see on TV was pretty amazing. Yeah.